like I mentioned before, we are so looking forward to where are we going? Alright. Can we steal a car? Damn it. We'd like to steal a car. Uh Mario Golf coming this weekend. I'm gonna try it on absolutely everything. Alright, I, I like a little fight. Let's go. Really? Bring it on. Suspicious men. Cool. Hungry homeless. Battle bomb. Don't attack us, even if you're gonna try and take the money. Ooh, job rank went up. Moving up in the world. Ah, boy. But a rank means extra health, which is always important in this game. Coming or what? Wow, that hitbox is really, really wide, I see. Across the street, the right spot. Hmm? Hmm? Nothing there. I'm gonna have to go eat something. いらっしゃいませ。ありがとうございましたthe walk over bridge. Come on, you can do it. Keep going. 
I ain't paying for no taxi, by the way, if you're wondering. Oh. Oh, here we go. Really? I'll get rid of him first. Then we'll see who else comes in. Oh, and you got another bully. That definitely did take a ton of uh, MP there, but... Told about this joint by an old guy hanging around Hello Work. Huh? Hello Work? Oh yeah, that was my doing. Told Kambe over there to recruit a couple of guards. Hamako-san, don't do things like that without asking me. I'm not made of money. Five thousand yen for a man to risk his life is a hell of a deal. I'm just amazed Kambe found two guys who took it. Really? Hey, wait a second. We never said anything about risking our lives. What is this job exactly? I'll explain everything. Come over here, boys. Uh-oh. You see all these restaurants on the river? They're all bars, just like ours. We've all been getting hit by thieves for decades now. Burglars? Nope. These thieves don't steal physical items or money. They steal electricity. What? How do they do that? Look over there at those wires. Those aren't public electric lines. The thieves strung those up ages ago. Do you know who they are? Wait, I've heard about this. Shit, it's the Komi Jewel. Uh, what's the Komi Jewel again? They're one of the Ejin Three, the Korean Mafia. Mm. And didn't you say how they got their name earlier? Yeah, it's not their official name. It's the neighborhood where they're headquartered. Well, it's still kind of hard to say, if you ask me, but I guess I see how they got it. Mm-hmm. They've been jacking our electricity for such a long time. I'm sick of them getting away with it. Each month it costs the bars here tens of thousands of yen. Each and every bar is forced to pick up the tab, and they don't reimburse us. Here's a solution. Why not just call the police? Yeah, I mean, the police ain't gonna do shit. Tell the cops exactly who's robbing you. They'd leap at the chance to take down a crime faction. No, they won't. I'm sure she has a good reason for not calling it in. Am I right? Of course. Whatever the reason, this kind of stuff is why we have cops. The police wouldn't touch Gomichua with a ten-foot pole. The area is too dangerous, even for them. Yep. I mean, how dangerous are we really talking? <laughs> you don't come back alive as how we're talking. <laughs> you gotta be exaggerating. I wish I was. 
Everyone who gets close to their HQ disappears. Everybody. Yakuza, police, doesn't matter. Not even the other Ijin gangs are willing to go there now. The place is a graveyard. Oh, Jesus. Okay, well, do you know anyone in the Komi Jewel? Of course not. Thank goodness. <laughs> well, then we'll have to find one of them while he's away from HQ. They gotta leave sometime. No, you can't tell them apart from civilians. They don't exactly wear freaking pins on their lapels like you Yakuza. There's no way to recognize them. Out of the Ijin 3, they're the most secretive by far. Oh, great. Okay, if there are no other options, then it's back to the original idea. We just go to their HQ. Again, that's suicide. You want another idea? I got one. All right. Cut your power grams. I can't do that, and I shouldn't have to. People's livelihoods are at stake. Come on, there's got to be something we can do. Ichiban, let's forget this. Seriously, we don't need money that bad. Hey, crazy idea, but why not just cut the damn cord? Long as you know which one to cut, I mean. Don't be an idiot. He's not. I had the exact same idea. I cut their line yesterday. What? You got a screw loose, lady? I didn't like the idea. I tried to stop her. Yeah, I felt bad afterwards. Mama was crying, worrying about how they would retaliate. Oh, we've been arguing about doing it for so long. Yesterday, I strolled on up and yanked it out of there. Just left it lying in the dirt. <laughs> I guess I've hit that age where you stop caring. Nice. That's not an excuse. What happens now? Well, that's what I hired you guys to figure out. You can't be serious. Okay, so you cut the cord yesterday. Anything happened since then? When Mama showed up to open the bar this morning, this was on the floor. Someone threw it through the window. Fix the cable by tonight. So they want you to connect it again. What'll happen if you just... don't? You think their message might be an empty threat? The thing is, if it's not, we won't know they're attacking until the last moment. Because we don't know what they look like. Plus, no way is it an empty threat. Look, lady. I get how your bar must be very important to you, and you don't want to close it. But this is insane. Oh, now this isn't even my bar. I'm just the barfly who buzzes around here the most. Ah! I wanted guards because I'm worried about Mama here. What? So you don't even have real skin in the game? You should start minding your own business, which is what I'm gonna do. I'm leaving. Good. Who needs a coward as a guard anyway? Get on out of here if you're gonna cry about it. Fine. Wish I could say it's been nice. Casca, let's go. I'm not going anywhere. I'm so sorry for all the trouble. Please forgive us. Hey, what are you gonna do for protection? I'll get their power cable hooked back up. Then if they're still angry, I'll offer them money not to bother us. I can take out a loan. What? That's ridiculous. We can't let them do this to you. You be quiet. It's your fault in the first place. Stop. She's right. We can't let them get away with this. No, what now? Paying off criminals just makes the whole world a worse place. <laughs> the job still pays 5,000 yen? Yeah. I knew that's all Mama could afford. I don't have more. It's fine. I'm in. Hold on, man. It's too risky. Yeah, it might can't be risky. Be choosers, you said. And honestly, I prefer a job where I get to help somebody out. See? Now that's the right attitude. I could tell you were a good guy. Unlike some people. <sighs> you old battle axe. <laughs> Are you sure about this? Yeah, I always mean what I say. We'll take the job. Wait a damn minute, we? You're roping me into this? Yes, I am. If you're not in, don't let the door hit you on the way out. This brave man has a job to do. Uh, do you know how obnoxious you are? Fine, I'll do it. Is everybody happy now? Good, so it's settled. Hey, it's a happy little party family. There you go, Mama. I got you two guards. Now how about rustling up a drink for me?
So we're gonna have to take on somebody here right away. They're all set up as creepy as hell. Looks like tentacles. Why do they need so much electricity anyway? I have no idea. Whoa, easy, Tiger. You trying to get wasted? Dude, we're risking our lives for a measly 5,000 yen. Chill out, man. We're probably not gonna die. <laughs> probably, so... Well, I'm glad one of us is taking this seriously. It's hitting me for the first time how spooky the Komijo are. Hiding their faces. But then again, they've also stayed hidden in their headquarters for freaking decades now. Yep. I don't see them coming out to this bar. Not for one power cable. Oh, they so will. you think the note was an empty threat? I think they assumed we'd obey. They know people are terrified of them. They know that for damn sure. Most people would have done whatever was written on that cinder block, no question. But Komichu must have believed that too. I doubt they actually plan to show up tonight and break kneecaps or something. But what'll happen when they check the cable and see that they didn't scare us into doing it? I mean, maybe it'll just throw another brick or whatever. Then what happens after that? We basically decided we're never hooking hey, back Mr. up. Hey, Mr. HPC, right? how you how doing are they tonight? Let that slide? Well, if that's the just logic, having a little bit of fun here with Yakuza here? once again. We're away. sitting here being Let's bouncers just tell these for women an empty threat and get out of here. For some reason, the Korean mafia is stealing our power. Damn, she has good for this old for lady at her bar. Bad. So the barfly by bought Why? us as muscle. So what is it? Gave my thoughts on Hell in a Cell. Said basically it was okay, There's nothing great, nothing really too stupid. We I'll announced another anyone. match for Clandestine coming out July 1st. I swear, I saw him. Oh, Jesus. She's making popcorn, scaring the crap out of all of us. <laughs> You're making us jumpy for no reason, man. Good evening. Is this your first time here? Yeah, oh, that's more is. than... Oh, there they are. Namba, that's the guy who was at Hello Work. Sure is. Guess he's here to spend money while he's unemployed. Typical, isn't it? No, I don't think he's here to spend money. Huh? Yeah! Stop! Did the Comey Jewel send you? Hey, hey, wait! Alrighty, I think we got a chase scene going on here. Leave me the fuck alone! Hell no. Why'd you attack us? I was hired to. Some guy said they paid me a million yen to wreck that bar. Were they Korean Mafia? They were, weren't they? I don't know. I'd never seen them before. They just came up to me in the park. I, I was drinking and minding my own business. But hey, I wasn't about to turn down an easy mill. <laughs> and you don't even think about getting between me and that money. $10,000 basically to... Not a loser. Really? Yeah. Take him out, and he's done. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. Really shouldn't have had to use my special, but like I said, I just... Ooh, silver safe skeleton key. So now I can access all the silver skeleton... Silver saves. Uh, uh, holy fuck. What's your name? I saw you in line at Hello Work. I remember what it was. Not so, right? <laughs> What's it to you? Listen, buddy. You didn't really think they'd give you a million yen, did you? Just for trashing a place? You think they were scamming me? 
Do you expect anything else from the Korean Mafia? You do know that's who hired you, right? <laughs> yeah? Makes you say that? They're the only ones who would want that bar messed up in the first place. Look, we're trying to help you. There's no way in hell they're gonna pay a million to some drunk bum. Nope, hmm. they're gonna kill you like right now. you're after. an expert. Hey, what did he look like? The guy who asked you to do this. Did you see his face? Uh, I don't know. Can't remember. Come on, we're not fucking around. Cut it out, Namba. No, I think this guy's legit. If you really want to know, ask the bitch. Bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Wait! Ichiban, don't chase him! Stop! They'll kill you if you go on their turf! Did you see that? He was smiling. They pulled yeah. him out so they could start doing it. I think it. he wasn't hired by the Komi Jewel. No way. He was a member. Oh shit. This is going from bad to worse. Still stuck on the bitch thing. You think there's a woman in the Comey Jewel? How would I know? Anyone could be a bitch these days. <laughs> it is 2021. Hey, look. Run! God damn it. We're sitting ducks. What are we gonna do? Okay, it's all or nothing. So what are we gonna do now? We're gonna actually go after her? Hey! Call me Joel! Hey, what are you doing? It doesn't matter to me one bit if that guy was one of your own, which is the clueless bum! But you have him back now! Then why not let us go? And you won't have our bodies to dispose of. What you and I both know is a huge pain in the ass. Would you stop? By the way, you know your little power cable? We cut it because it was like tying a noose around that poor bar's neck. If you hang him with it and they close down, you won't be getting that power anyway. So you need to give it up. Nice. You're the one who needs to give up. Look, you guys are real ass mafia, right? You shouldn't be doing small-time shit like stealing electricity! So cut it out! Fine. I don't care anymore. We're dead. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's being honest. There is no way you're not gonna get dead from- Oh. <laughs> he nicked the cheek. Are you satisfied? What? No way. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Thanks, guys. This hey, man has got the power there. of persuasion everywhere. Is this guy for real? But they're getting killed with arrows? Like, what is this? A little crossbow arrow action here. Yippee ki yay, -yay Mother Heather. So we come back to the bar. <laughs> All right, more text that we have to read. Damn it! Welcome back. Hmm. Huh? <laughs> I guess they didn't want to mess with our hired guns. You really saved me. I can't believe you already took care of it. Uh, yeah. I mean, I guess it's taken care of. Hold on. Why do you think it's all settled? We just got a phone call. Probably from that man who was just here. Huh? Huh? You mean Matsuo? He called? Hi. He said, sorry about earlier. Just leave the cable how it is. Sounds settled to me. Wow. Seriously? Man. We did it, Ichiban! <sighs> Damn. Was Masuda really part of Gimma? 
How'd you pull it off? It's nothing special, just did what you hired me to do. Look at you, serving some humble pie. Oh, no. Here's what I owe you. Huh? 5,000 yen. Throw a Makosan money. That's all I have to give. What's up? So we helped him out. That's good enough. Blah, blah, blah. Just trying to be the good guy. My life's only worth 2,500 yen, huh? That's enough. Then let me give you some more work. Come work at my place tomorrow, I'll give you 5,000, and we'll call it even. Sup? You run a bar too, Hamako-san? I don't think so. Don't be a fool. You think I run a hole in the wall like this? Further down the river, there's a small row of restaurants. I'm down there. Okay. Ah. Small restaurants. Hmm. Need you to clean one of them, and I won't expect anything less than sparkling. Got it. Great. When I should ask, what are your names? Okay. Nanba. Kasuga. You got first okay. name, Ichiban. Ichiban Kasuga, I swear it's not fake. <laughs> it's a nice name, very proudly. Look at the leopard pants on her, oh my goodness. Can you tell she... Is that where they came up with the cougar thing? What? All silver safe scattered throughout the city. Cool! <laughs> you need a drink at eating establishments, indulgence, fashion only, restore lost health, but also give you experience points. Certain combinations of items ordered will net you bonus experience points. So don't be afraid to mix and match. As the season goes, good conscience is good to All right. the way we want to go. I'm going to go beat up those two guys up in front there. It's always good to get a few beat ups in. Ooh, what do we got here? Okay, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Ragged cloth. Nice. All right, deadbeats, get over here. Hello. There we go. Steamed punk and a punkling. Nice little drop kick with the uh, umbrella. Hey, don't you go. <laughs> Nobody likes you. Nobody likes you. I'll take my ten bucks. Let's keep going. I guess we're not going in there. Oh, 
Alright, another fight. Suspicious man. A battle bum and a homeless hungry bum. Pick on the battle bum here, see what he got. Not much. Agreed. All right, so let's go hit up that restaurant now. Oh, we got more company. Oh, wait, what we got here? Uh, another battle bum and a homeless hungry guy. All right. Ten more bucks, some more seaweed. Hell yeah! And my weak guy leveled up. That's good. The boar pork soup, piping hot. All right, let's go. Oh, we got more crap pots to deal with. Wait, what do we got here? Spider! Alright, I gotcha! Last time I caught you a bug was back when I was a kid. You never know when you might need a bug on your side. Now keep it. I love the crazy music we got here for these guys, though. Let's get the battle bomb out of the way here. productive keeps me put I know I'm the same way like truth be known I was thinking about possibly canceling tonight but then uh, last night during the pay-per-view it was so exciting I managed to get my last uh, match edited for episode one of uh, CS2 so all right before we do anything I want to heal up here both healed. Let's get back to our uh, little home. Well, we've got a job to do, Ma. Better make sure we don't oversleep. Okay. Good night. Alright, next cutscene. So we've taken on the Korean Mafia while you were gone, uh, Jupiter. Uh, we've, uh, what else? Saved an old lady's bar. Now we're going to go clean another lady's bar for another five grand. And, yeah, we sold, saved an old lady's bar. We've attacked the Korean Mafia. They've attacked us. We almost died. We're going to clean a bar right away, or a restaurant, sorry. Um, got cut up across the face. Tried to go for a job, but since we don't have a home, they won't give us anything. They send us to a support center.
Hey. All right, let's head over to Hamako-san's restaurant. Well, that was useful. So it was just down the river, as I recall. All right. We're all charged up and ready to go, so let's go for it. Oh, here we go. Let's go for some more battles. Oh, come on, give me something serious. And the capitalist punisher will try to call somebody right away as soon as I... Oh, we got another guy. I need to find somebody a little bit more... If we find somebody a little bit bigger, I'm going to show the tag team move that we do now. Because we got like a combination Hadouken, uh, Scissor Kick, the power of friendship. Yeah, it's, it's weird. Alright, we almost made it. Let's go hit up our restaurant. There she is. Seriously, the same leopard pants as yesterday. Oh, you're here. Morning, ma'am. Get up. We're closing for a few hours. <laughs> hey, tell everyone up there to leave. Oh, so it's one of those what restaurants. Time is it? Let me sleep a bit more, Hamako-san. I'm having the place clean. I need everyone out till tonight. They said it was a restaurant. This is not a restaurant. How many customers did you get yesterday? I don't know, at least five. Where were you? I'm exhausted. No. <laughs> Small restaurant, huh? They cater to a very specific appetite. That would be putting it politely. Now we gotta go clean a whorehouse. Ew. Damn, it's too damp to even dust this thing. Oh! Hey, Jiban. Can you deal with these tissues? <laughs> you do it. It's your job. <sighs> Bodily fluids really aren't my thing. Cut me some slack. Wow. You want to get paid or not? Would you rather say broke and homeless? No, but it doesn't mean I don't have standards. <sighs> don't be a diva. Nah. Constitution's got to go! Get out of E.G. Cho! Get out! Oh, God. Attention, all Riverside business owners! This is Sota Kume, president of Bleach Japan's Yokohama chapter! Bleach Japan! Constitution's got to go! Get out of Eiji Cho! Really? Attention, all Riverside business owners! This is Sota Kume, president of Bleach What's all the racket? Oh, you don't know them? It's Bleach Japan. Constitution's got to go! Bleach now! Get out of What's Bleach Japan? Pretty sure we know exactly what it is. It's, it's a non-profit group. What you'd call an NPO. Been around 15 years. Their slogan is, Bleaching the Gray Zones White. You know how some things fall into the gray area? Neither black nor white? Like things that are technically illegal, but cops look the other way because they're victimless crimes. Yeah. They don't like that. They want to crack down on all crime, whether it hurts someone or not. They want to bleach the gray so that it's white. 
This town is just full of metaphors, huh? Wow. The group's active all over the country now. Makes sense, considering their founder is Rio Aoki. And that is... Uh, he's the governor of Tokyo? Oh, the one oh. that was cleaning up the city. With that, uh... Comrocho 3K plan. Wow, you actually got one right. Ah! Well, that plan made Aoki real popular. The media adored him before he was governor, but they love him even more now. He resigned from Bleach Japan when he went into politics. But he still sings their praises. The young voters eat it up. Okay, but why are they protesting right outside this building? This establishment here is registered as a restaurant. But you won't find a speck of food on the second floor. If you're lucky, a waitress might bring you some tea. Of course, you don't pay for that tea. You pay for something else. Let's just call it what it is. A brothel. Everybody in this neighborhood knows it. This is crime, pure and simple. Happening right out in the open for decades now. The women who work here have been brainwashed. They don't realize what they're getting into. And once they're in, they can't get out. We demand an end to this human tragedy. We demand it! Oh, shut up, you whiners. These women are just working hard at their jobs. So working hard excuses a crime? You could learn from them. What right do you have to tell anyone how to live? And why be so dishonest? Registering yourselves as a restaurant. I'll tell you why. It's because the truth is so terrible! Wow. No. It's because grown-ups do things they don't want to, to protect people. The only people you're protecting are your loan officer and your debt collectors. You ass. You ever consider why a woman might do this job? Because they have needs. Some are caring for their parents. Some have little kids. This is a way for them to support their families. Dead silence. Did you hear that? Not only are they criminals, they're raising children! How can those children turn out normal? At best, they'll grow up hating their completely unfit parents! They are good parents. They keep their children happy and healthy, and that's what truly matters. Wow. Show me one, then. Show me a child who's happy being raised by a whore! You aren't even trying to understand. You're just being an asshole. Leave us alone! There aren't any happy kids like that, are there? No child wants a prostitute for a mother. I never minded it. Huh? <laughs> Itchy bond. You all came here because you want to get rid of the trash. I got that right? Well, here oh, it is. Oh, shit. Get ready to catch. Oh, shit. Here we go. Wait, hold on. Wouldn't that be the... Take this! Wow, they left in a hurry. <laughs> wow, that was funny. <laughs> Not bad, Ichiban. If you guys didn't see chapter one, Ichiban was actually raised in a soap house from birth. He was abandoned, so... It actually fits in quite perfectly there, and yeah. It's so amazing how this game is reflecting real life and bringing a lot of personal stories into it. But I wish I could actually do something in this. But I've been told it speeds up, so, you know... What I might end up doing here, and I don't know what you guys... Let me know in the chat what you guys think. Would it be okay if I maybe set this up for one day a week that we go through it? It's about 45... Uh... Yeah, I'm I'm the same way, Jupe. Like, if you can regulate something, it's a lot easier than trying to make it illegal for something that people are going to do anyway. Hell, wrestling was the same way.
I'd rather see them be protected and whatnot. <sighs> now they're marching around almost every week. A lot of places have shut down thanks to them. <laughs> wow. But you're holding out for all the girls you got here, right? Most of them don't have Japanese citizenship. Their children or grandchildren are illegal immigrants. Hmm. If they shut down, where would they go? For being honest, they would probably fall, fall in with some leeches who'd skim off most of their earnings. <laughs> so what can I do to protect them myself, you know? Sup? Think you can keep it up? Who knows? I own the place, but I'm just leasing the land. If the owner told me to leave, that'd be the end of it. Hmm? Come back from more of your trash, fellas. True. You really d did a number on us this afternoon. You're still out protesting at this hour? Do you even have a permit? No. This isn't a protest. Bleach Japan helps the drown trodden in the weak, too. <laughs> Sometimes that means giving people like these guys our support. They were just hanging around a hamburger joint in front of the station. They lived on the cheap, processed food their whole lives. I know where this is going. They don't even know what a good meal tastes like, and that could stunt your growth. So we're trying to give them an opportunity here. Tonight, Bleach Japan will cover the bill. Oh yeah? What are you getting at? Oh. I just thought I'd take these boys feast on some high-class cooking from this fine establishment. Uh, uh, Glad you Really thought Yo. this through. Hold on. What's the point of taking him somewhere with no food? That's exactly what he wants to hear. My permit says I run a restaurant, so I can't refuse. What are you going to do then? Guess I'll feed him until the money runs out. <laughs> and I suppose my part is at an end here. I'll leave you to, to enjoy your meal. That is, if they have any food to serve. Looking forward to hear all about Goodbye. it. Goodbye. All righty. Oh. <laughs> 10,000 yen each. Eat up. Right. You fuck with this granny. Oh, not a fan of crackers? I have some cookies, I think. They're a little moldy, though. You call that food? Well, I wouldn't eat it, but I think it's appropriate for the occasion. Oi. Hey, you take us for food? Hold on. Calm down, fellas. We're perfectly allowed to be dissatisfied customers. Yeah, get us some real food. Hey. Oh, shut up. Stop complaining and get out of here. Soka. Oh, I see. You're saying that the place doesn't have anything to eat? Guess we'll go tell Bleach Japan guy you gave us the money then. <laughs> you gonna pretend that wasn't your goal from the start? That sob story was as thin as paper. You guys got hired to mess with her business, so get out of here. Ow, hey, the old guy's getting violent with us. He ain't old. You hit us first, so consider this self-defense. Oh. Okay. About frickin' time, let's go! Let's do it! Yeah. They're all level 8, so there's not much. You're gone. And you miss. And you
I just want to get one last turn out of the way here. Zonk out on the spot and show my health back up. Thank you. Now I'm now I'm pissed. Okay, you're gone. Uh, you know what? I got enough of this energy here. I might as well use it, right? I got this. Have fun with this. Watch this. Yeah, you're gone. I just want to get through that. Yeah, we made it. Leave like a freaking sieve, but I'm up. Which means I get to refill everything. Nice. MP, HP, they're all up. That's beautiful. Great job. Learned new job skilled headbutt barrage. There we go. Moving up in the world. And the old man, they're pyro belch. Oh, goody. Like I said, I need to find a big boss so I can show you this tag move. Uh, how can an old guy be so strong? Uh, whatever. I'll see you around, Grandpa. You kids have a lot of spunk. Why don't you use it to help your parents for once? Exactly. I never thought Bleach Japan would resort to this type of thing. A bunch of dreamers. They really think they can bleach the gray zones? Come on. I don't think they'll ever get a chance to do that. They swagger around like they've got some noble purpose. But all they really want are donations. And let's face it. What they're doing is just plain bully. <sighs> Whatever happened to good manners? I'm just tired of people when they don't accept that not everybody has the same opinion. Yeah, well, it's pretty late now. Let's go home. Sure. Sorry you had to rescue me twice. Don't sweat it. Call us if you need cleaners again. Yeah, but you didn't pay us. Hold on a minute. Hmm? You two are homeless, right? Yeah. Well, here's a proposition. What if you just lived here, in one of the rooms upstairs? What? Huh? Really? Really? I mean, that'd be a huge help. Do you even have a room to spare? Don't the girls need them to work in? Well, I'm not making the offer out of complete selflessness. Okay, what does that mean? So are we just going to be some kind of security or what? We should be coming up close to the end of the chapter here right now, so. 
just based roughly on how much time the last chapters have been. But yeah, like we were talking, I do like the fact that this does go over a lot of uh, real life scenarios and whatnot. Like Jupiter mentioned earlier, like I'm in the same boat where I just prostitution should just be legal. Government would appreciate it for the tax money they get. Workers would be safer for the most part. Look what happened when you legalized marijuana in Canada. It got a lot safer. And yeah, sorry, Jupiter, I beat you to it a little quick here. I'd rather you bring everything you wide out in the open the right so everybody can just go at it. What's a right of residence? It means that you can legally assert that you have the right to live somewhere. I don't get it. How would that benefit you? Well, I live in a different building. This is my business, but since I don't live here, I don't get that right of residence. Oh, I think I get it. Mm-hmm. I'm leasing this building, you see? And if Bleach Japan really wants to get us evicted, they might pressure the owner of the property. Wouldn't put it past them. But, if someone here has right of residence, we can fight back. Once you have that right, the owner can't just evict you for no reason. Fair enough. Oh, so us living in the place would be a line of defense for you. Exactly. You get it. Sounds like a great deal. But you don't mind a couple bums living here? Well, you two are really my only choice of renters. The women who work here aren't citizens. So, I can't enter into a lease contract with them. But boys, that's not the only reason I'm making this offer. I'm impressed with what you two did. Sounds good to me. I don't mind being your live-in security guard. Nice. Oh, wonderful. Just promise you won't break the lease. I want your eyes on my shop for a long time. Until Bleach Japan finds someone else to bother. You got it. Thanks a lot. Hopefully they can find a way to uh, help everybody else there eventually, but. These two have moved on to bigger things. It's going to be really, it's going to be really funny if that, that was the end of the chapter. Because that was definitely no boss right there. And it's funny, Jupiter, you're talking about left wing and right wing. I don't even know what each wing is, to be honest, when it comes to political views. And I'm left-handed as well, so. I will say I'm a lefty in that sense. But um, right wing, left wing, I don't know. I'm, I'm all over the yes. place. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> look, Ichiban, a roof. A real roof. <laughs> yeah, look, man, it's freaking amazing. This is our castle. A roof, four walls, and a soft throne. Yeah, I'm just happy to be Actually, on the plane. this throne's kind of damp. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, is there? I'm pretty sure it's not water. <laughs> well, just think of all the history you're sleeping with every time you drift off on that mat. <laughs> Always a silver lining with you, isn't there? Then again... I guess that's how you got us here in the first place. Hmm. Thank you, Ichiban. Come on. I should be the one thanking you. I'd be dead and rotting in a trash can if you didn't save me. <laughs> hey, why'd you quit nursing anyway? <laughs> I don't know. You must have been good if you saved me. Truth is, I was smuggling drugs out of the hospital and selling them. Damn. The money was pretty good. Eventually, I expanded to dealing drugs from overseas. But I got too big. And it all came crashing down. Comes crashing down, and it hurts inside. 
Yeah, man. What were you thinking? Kind of a boneheaded move. What? You don't think I regret it? Okay, well, why not start over? The whole nurse thing is probably out, but you can apply your medical skills to something else. I was thinking more about the Easier opposite. You're going done. to the gym, Jupiter. What about you? You got another job in mind? Uh, uh, Thanks for the mental image, really. by the way. I've been walking in someone else's footsteps for years, and now they're washed away. I don't know where to go now that I can't see them. I'm pretty lost. You talking about your patriarch? Yeah. A guy like you, you can find something. What makes you so sure? I'm over 40, you know? Weren't you the one just telling me I could turn it all around and find something? Yeah, yeah my bad. Sorry. <sighs> Life is work. Hey, tell me this. What'd you want to be when you were a kid? Uh, oh. <laughs> you really want to know? Come on, don't build it up. Spit it out. Okay, I'll tell you. When what I was what? a kid, all I wanted to be was a hero. Huh? A hero? What do you mean? You know, a hero who could save people. Like in Dragon Quest. <laughs> the video game? <laughs> How would you do that? <laughs> Dude, come on. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, yeah. What? I can have a dream, can I? No, you're you not allowed to, to dream. Laugh at it. A dream is what keeps you going. For me, anyway. Ichiban, you're right. Uh, uh, I am? Yeah, so I see you do it. Become a hero. Just like you wanted. Come on, I was just a dumb kid when I wanted that. It was silly. <laughs> it's not like you got any other goals right now. So why not go after the first one you had? Live your life's dream. You're crazy. It's not like being a hero puts a roof over your head. I need a hero! Sure, it's not a job. But... If the hero destroys lots of slimes in the do game, we, do we go Bonnie Tyler fast, or right? do we go Enrique Iglesias? See what I'm saying? Leveling up in life. That could work. Yeah. Hell yeah. Want to be Why a hero, but a hero actually a villain right? like a snipe. Hmm. Snape. It ain't the best age to start grinding, but. <laughs> All right then. I'm ready to level up. Let's start a brand new age of heroes. Yeah, I'm with you, Ichiban. Let's have a toast to our new era in our new home. Yeah, to the heroes of tomorrow. Cheers. Nice. Heroes of tomorrow. Speaking of which, I'm pretty sure that's where this is ending this chapter no oh shit please let me go I swear I'll tear that fucking bar down look I know I messed up I, I don't even want the money anymore J just give me another chance what the hell how about this I could kill the two guys who got in the way I already know how to do it. Oh, you'd like that, yeah? You want them dead, don't you? Don't you? Nigga, Kokyan Alpirian Nopso. Kagenin Chana Hedda. Namujin Riga Rasa Chariaji. Wait, I didn't catch that. I should have known not to rely on trash like you. Son of a biscuit. Chugara. Crossbow killer. Okay. You want to talk about leaving something on a cliffhanger? <laughs> 